Israel Gaza Iran War News Live Update Razi boosted Russia Iran relations. Russian President Vladimir Putin has stated that the late Iranian President Ebrahim Raisi was instrumental in strengthening ties between Russia and Iran, and that Russia will work to maintain the progress that Raisi achieved during his presidency. We are maintaining and strengthening the agreements made during Raisi's administration, and we are making good progress toward our goals. In response to Ali Naduri, managing director of Erna, Putin stated on Wednesday that Mr. Raisi had a major part in this matter, his relationships with us were dependable, cordial, and businesslike. Putin praised the late Iranian president, saying, he was a fascinating person, and he was a serious politician, a loyal partner. The president and his entourage were killed in a helicopter crash on May 19. A little amount of sarcasm and humor were hallmarks of President Raisi's outlook on life. It was fascinating to keep in touch with him immediately. This topic we are discussing will not be forgotten for a long time if we can reach an agreement with him, so it was both intriguing and useful, Putin continued. He went on to praise Raisi for elevating Iran's profile internationally after its accession to the BRICS Group of Developing Nations and the Shanghai Cooperation Organization. Iran played and continues to play a very important role in this and this is still an indication that we were moving in the right direction, Putin added, referring to the growth of a multipolar world, Arbabil province is the site of the capture of a Mossad spy by Iranian intelligence personnel. In the northwest Iranian province of Ardabil, Iranian intelligence agents have apprehended a person they believe to be working for the Israeli regime's Mossad intelligence organization and are holding him on espionage charges. The Iranian intelligence ministry wanted the wanted fugitive, whose identity was not immediately known. The Ardabil province prosecutor's office issued the order that led to his capture. The provincial prosecutor's office's media bureau claims that the Mossad spy gained crucial information for prominent Israeli intelligence personnel while posing as a news editor and maintained close touch with them through social media. Prior to his identification and capture in Ardabil province, he had traversed other provinces in search of sanctuary and ultimately departed the nation. According to reports, the spy was born and raised in a southern Iranian province. The news of Mossad's arrest apparently caused him to swiftly resolve to delete all associated information and close his user accounts. The Iranian intelligence ministry announced earlier this year that its troops had discovered a large number of Mossad-affiliated spies in 28 different countries. On February 2, the ministry made an announcement about what it called the largest joint intelligence and counterintelligence operation against the security and espionage groups within the Israeli regime. According to the statement, the venturesome operation gathered a unique and unprecedented amount of information via a combination of intelligence counterintelligence, offensive defensive, and other methods of gathering intelligence. According to the statement, among the achievements of the ministry's large and multi-stage operation include gathering intelligence and security findings, as well as specific details about the secret military bases, weapons factories, and strategic civilian industries of the overthrowing Zionist regime.